Hello, Nuggets. Okay, so I wanted to start a uh, new playlist, new series. Uh, I actually tried it to do tried to do this before, and I wasn't enjoying it. Uh, I think you got to be really good at the game, and I've only been playing it this year, which is Football Manager. Um, it's a very intense strategy game. I think you'll be really good at it to um, to both play it and to uh, stream it. And I've got great admiration for the YouTube streamers who do it. But I want to have another go at it because I love the game, right? And I had an idea, like a concept what I wanted to follow. Um, so I want to start a new one. So I want to show you this map. So this is a map of the big clubs in London, right? Now, if you take a look at that, you'll see that we got Crystal Palace, Millwall, West Ham. So now this is what I was thinking. I was brought up. I moved around a lot, right? But I spent my teenage years in East London, and East London's got its fair share. We've got West Ham, we've got Dagenham and Redbridge out here, and we've got Millwall. Some might say it's south of the river, so it's South London, but it's right by the Isle of Dogs. They're East Enders. I mean, they're not, but you know what I mean? The Millwall bricks and East End tool. <laughs> so they're right on the edge, right? Uh, and then you go north, you've got Tottenham and Arsenal. You go west, you've got tons of Muppets over there. You've got Chelsea, Fulham, Queen's Park. There's all sorts over there. You go south, you've got Crystal Palace. And they're pretty new, right? I mean, it's not, you know, they're, they're up and down. They're not great. They're, there's, I mean, Crystal Palace fans, I'm sure, will tell me different. But they, I don't know. They don't have quite the passion that the others have. And I think that's because they've had an up and down. They've been around a long time. Um, and true fans will tell you different. But it's not got the same kind of heritage to me right? Oh, I'm going to get angry. <laughs> People get angry about that. Um, and I spent a lot of time in South London. Um, when I was very young, we lived in Streatham. Um, so I spent a lot of time in Streatham, in uh, Brixton. My, uh, my half-sister, she lives out in Lewisham for a while, and now I think she's down in Sydenham. Um, so yeah, there's a lot of areas around here that I know, I know Battersea very well. I lived in Vauxhall for a while. I know Lambeth well. So I want to put a Premier League team right there, right right somewhere in here in the middle. That's what I want to do. I want to give South London a Premier League team to rival Crystal Palace, to be more consistent than Crystal Palace. I'm not as far out, frankly, as Crystal Palace, because it's all the way out here. Right in here to give it what for to Millwall, who are also up and down a bit, to give it what for to Chelsea, who are never up and down, and to Fulham, who are a little bit more consistent, but also up and down. So South London needs a representative that is always in the Premier League. So we're going to build a dynasty. And this is how we're going to do it. Dulwich. <laughs> Not exactly the bad boys of soccer. soccer. But the reason I want to do it with Dulwich is uh, I went to school for a very short while in, at a school called Alain's, which was like a partner school to Dulwich College. A very posh school, which is why I only went there for a couple of years. Um, I did not fit in <laughs> at all. It was a horrible experience, um, but it was a very good school. But uh, Dulwich is a lovely place, right? It's a really nice place. Um, the ground is nice. Uh, I actually wanted to, I looked for something in Streatham, but I actually couldn't find a team. And I, I, I downloaded custom databases. Um, I did everything I could to try and find a team in Streatham that would fit for what I want. Couldn't find one, you know. So I've, Dulwich is in Vanarama South, so they're the lowest level of the <coughs> excuse me the vanilla database. Perfect. It's right down there. It's a long way to go. It's a nice, good save that we can work our way up. We can build a dynasty. So <coughs> that's what we're going to do. We're going to build Dulwich up. We're going to take them all the way up the tables. We're going to get them into the Premier League. We're going to hopefully get, eventually we're going to get Champions League. It will take a long time to get up there. Um, they're not in a terrible state. You take a quick look. I've only just taken over, so, you know, I haven't even gone through the emails. I click one email. This is the name of the character. His name is Daddy Cool. <laughs> As you can probably tell from the uh, intro video, the intro titles. Um, he's based on me. He's a good looking chap, isn't he? Look at him. Look at him. He is handsome. Where is he? My profile. Oh, God, he's a good looking man. Look at that. Gorgeous features. Proud. Roman nose. All of those chins are fantastic. Every single one of them. What a beautiful man. Um, 
Anyway, so he's in charge, just took over. Uh, what was I showing you there? So, yeah, it's a good club. They've got, um, you know, I mean, it's Vanarama South, right? So how much have they got? They've got average ticket bias is 10 quid. Uh, season ticket, 125. Season ticket, holders 350, which is actually pretty damn good for uh, this scale. They have rivals in Tooting and Mitcham, just around the corner. Other rivals in Leatherhead, God knows why. Bromley, which are just a little bit uh, east of them, south and east of them. Um... And here's the good news. So I didn't actually look too much into this, um, but as far as I can tell, this is a pretty good side. Um, it's it's not that deep. Uh, what have we got total? We've got 15 people, but this is pretty good. We're going to go in this in greater depth later, but there's a couple, of, like, look at this goalie. Block Jorgensen. Okay, so he's not got fantastic. Aerial reach 20 at this level is pretty damned astonishing. Uh, jumping reach 20 agility 17 that's pretty damn good so i think these guys gonna tear it up um i've got a uh, really good i mean it's i'm not crazy about his kicking he can't get rid of the ball and there are some problems here he's got zero well he's got one eccentricity um and his one-on-ones aren't great i'd really want better there but he's pretty good um and we've got a couple of other ones so uh, who's that guy i was looking at foes dominic foes this guy looks great uh, look, he can play a lot of positions. Look at dribbling. Look at these numbers. Yeah, there's a there's so this team overall looks good. I don't want to go into it too much detail. We'll go. There's only got a couple of they only got one loney and one loney out. Um, the club itself has uh, some pretty good facilities again for its level. They're okay rather. Three thousand five hundred capacity, six hundred twelve seated. Pretty good. Um, they own the club, which is oh no, it's owned by Tuton and Mitchum. Oh, I just noticed that. Okay, um, well, we'll fix that, won't we? Uh, pitch condition is perfect. They've got basic training facilities, but look at this. Basic youth facilities, all standard. Adequate junior coaching, that's actually good. Above average youth recruitment is good because we're going to need that. We're going to build a dynasty. We've got to have something to build on. So it's nice to be whatever the number is on that. It's not one. <laughs> it's probably two, but that's more than one, right? So pretty excited about that. If we take a quick look at the board, obviously I've just taken over here. What's the chairman's name? Um, I just got this new skin, so I'm still looking around a bit, but uh, I do like it. It's a good skin. Let's see. Confidence. Uh, oh, we're going to staff. Right? Let's have a look. Staff. Coaching team. Responsibilities. Liam Hickey. So he's the uh, chairman. Uh, Daddy Cool. That's me, or just Daddy, as I'm known as now, apparently. Uh, I've got an assistant manager, which is really good. They're already in. Although, I did. I think I took a quick peek at him. Why am I thinking I liked him? Oh, no. Okay, yes. So, not crazy about him. If you look at him, he's got... I mean, look at that. <laughs> it's fucking hell. Um, I, have, I mean, surely... You get, you get a point just for not being blind, right? Surely... <laughs> Surely you can judge, if he can run, if you can see him running towards you, you get a point. So that's pretty damn bad. And I know it's bad lower leagues, but two seems exceptionally bad. Um, however, this is interesting. If you look at Tamba Namna, Nongnu, Nongnu, Tamna Nongnu, he's a little better. He's our co coach, which is odd because I think he's better. Our coach is better than our um junior caddy and the reputation stars which i don't fully understand what these mean but look this guy's local this guy's unproven well yeah look i think the bars down here are bollocks <laughs> look junior caddy who's our current uh, coach our sister manager has a full bar uh tamba who is currently our coach has half a bar but if you highlight the role i mean we know what it is there's only three things manage management they're exactly the same Player ability, Tamba wins. Judging player potential, Tamba wins. So why on earth is Junior better? I think the answer is that he's not. Anyway. So we have a, we have some stuff to do there. We've got to get... Um, is that a head physio? Yes, we need to get a physio and we've got to get some scouts. We do already have a chief scout. Um, who's pretty bad. Um, who again is worse than our coach. <laughs> but you know what? It's early days yet. Um, I started the season a little bit early because I wanted to... Um, just do a, a, a little a few bits and pieces. The editor is turned on, but the only reason I turned it on is I wanted to change my name to Daddy because they were referring me to as cool, and I didn't want them to do that. I'm, I'm Daddy. 
<laughs> so we won't be using the editor to do anything. Um, that's pretty much it. I'll do a, go into a deeper overview, but we're going to take over Dulwich Hamlet. We're going to take them to the top. We're going to win the Premiership. Might take a few seasons to get there. And uh, they'll, we'll go through the team on the next one, figure out what the hell we're going to do with this little squad. What tactics we're going to give them, where we're going to take them. Fucking hell, look at some of these wages. Vanarama South, we're paying £600 a week? Actually, how far off are we on the finances? So, I mean, we have a little bit of wiggle room. Not much, though. So I feel that we can do some work uh, there, right? I don't know how good these players are, but, like, this guy is only three star. No, right here, look at that. Ashley Carew. Three stars. Oh, he's pretty good, isn't he? Well, anyway. It's a good team. I'm looking forward to this. Um, we're going to get into it next week. All right, you nuggets. Let's do it. Catch the next episode. All right, bye.